Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today's gonna be a quick, short cash stuffing. We have $896 um, that we're gonna stuff today. So, we let's get into it. We are gonna do $100 in self-care. I hope everyone is doing well on their budgets. It's today's, um, mid, we're in mid-May. And so we're halfway through the month. It's crazy how time flies. Um, but I did do a check-in with our budget and we're doing fairly well. So Aggie's not getting anything. I'm not getting anything. Family fun, we're going to do 50. Um, so yeah, here I don't, you know, I don't really do um, like try to get the bills exactly what I need. I usually swap things. Home goods, also going to get 50 and um the reason is because i i don't know i think it just works better for me when i swap bills um because i have the bills they're just mixed everywhere right so um we'll have to swap bills probably getaways we're gonna do 300 and i did mention that um we are planning a trip to hawaii um we did book our flights and we were able to use credit card points. So our flights uh, were technically zero dollars out of pocket. So I just wanna make sure $300. Um, we're also going camping this summer. So eating out is also gonna get a hundred just because, you know, this is the category we usually go over so eating out is going to get a hundred. We're going to jump into this binder. Guatemala is good. Friends is also going to get a hundred um, because that's technically another category that we sometimes go over just because we like to plan last minute things with friends. Home maintenance, nothing. Ministry, nothing. And gifts is going to get a hundred. Um, yeah, a hundred dollars should be enough to cover this month. And then clothing. Clothing is going to get $16. We want to see if I can swap out this 50. So here's 50, put it here. And then it's gonna get sixteen dollars, so ten, fifteen, sixteen. So that's good. So we should be left with eighty dollars because eighty dollars is gonna go into the laundry envelope. So twenty, forty, sixty, seventy, eighty. Perfect. But I want to see if I can swap out these 20s for 10s because at the laundry mat, um, they do not take um, anything bigger than a, 20, uh, a 10, actually. So I can't um, get quarters with a 20. And so um, that's that. $80 has been good for us. Um, lately uh oh i guess i might not have that change okay we're gonna do one go back to the binder see if there's any change here but anyways um so that's that i've been a little behind on my uh here's one on my business that I'm launching soon. Um, I'm hoping to finish the website this week. I'm not a website designer, so it, it gets a little, uh, it takes me longer essentially is what happens. Um, let's see, so I did that and see. So if I can't change, oh, let's see. Oh, here's another one. Great. And I think it's good for now. Um, I'll, the next cash stuffing, I might have more bills. 
uh, to swap out That's the last one. Oh, and we do have it. So 10, 20, great. So that's what I needed for laundry. I'm actually gonna go do laundry today. Um, and yeah, sorry, this was a quick short cash stuffing. Um, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. I usually average about 20, 15 to 20 dollars per uh, week for laundry. And um, yeah, it takes me about two hours to do laundry, which is fine. It's near our house. And while I'm doing laundry, I always run errands. I put on a timer to see how much I have time left until the, the washer finishes. And I run to the post office and bank and grocery store um, to do errands. So that's that. Thanks so much for, for watching. Um, I was supposed to do an update on the business, like a mini vlog. Um, I couldn't get to it, so I'm going to actually do that this week. Um, so yeah, thanks so much for watching. Bye now.